Hey guys, what's up? Tech Talk Noah here. I have hurt my wrist. I also have a brand new computer. Today we're going to be looking at my new computer. Yeah, that's what I thought too. I don't think the wrist thing is going to work out too well. Anyway, my old computer, which was a 2010 13-inch baseline MacBook Pro with a Core 2 Duo, uh, 4 gigs of RAM, uh, it was getting pretty dated, as you could imagine, with like heavy use and everything. So I decided to take the plunge and drop two and a half G's on a brand new mid-2015 15-inch MacBook Pro with Retina display. Now, to read off the specs to you guys, it has a 2.5 gigahertz Intel Core i7 processor, which is four cores with uh, hyper-threading. It has 16 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM. It has an AMD R9-370X graphics card, which claims to be 80% better than the old 750M from NVIDIA that was in this machine last year. It has 512 gigs of super fast SSD storage, PCIe based. It has a 15.4 inch 2880 by 1800 display, which is really crisp. And it is only 4.49 pounds for all of that might. So I bought this computer for a touch over $2,500, and that's because I'm a student and I get a student discount. Uh, but if you want to find out how to save money on Apple, go ahead and go watch my last video, which I will put in that little eye in the corner right about here. And you can go, or here, I don't know, you can go enjoy it and find out how you can get a cheaper MacBook or Mac or iPod? Does anybody use iPods anymore? When you unbox the MacBook, it's pretty much all standard stuff inside the box, um, including your power brick, extension cable... Um, user manual, and your Mac itself. Physically, the mid-2015 MacBook is identical to all the other uh, Retina MacBooks that have been um, made, so it's super thin. Like, like I look at this thing, I'm like, oh. And the two stereo speakers on the side of it are actually producing surprisingly good sound, like with deep bass. These speakers sound amazing for a laptop. The display is uh, gorgeous, as the Retina name implies, and it's a pleasure to look at anything on it. Moving on to the ports, we have a MagSafe 2 power port. We have two Thunderbolt 2 20 gigabit per second, 20 gigabyte, I think, gigabit, gigabyte, two of those Thunderbolt 2 ports. We have two USB 3.0 ports, a uh, headphone slash microphone jack, HDMI port, along with a card reader for all us video geeks. Going into like the performance, the meat and uh, potatoes of this machine, it's ridiculously powerful. Like the Geekbench scores are like in the 14,000s right up there with iMacs and like not up there with the MacBook Pro but like almost there. These things are insane to be honest for what it is, this tiny little machine. The SSD is also really, really fast. Like you think that your standard uh, SATA 2.5 inch SSD is fast. This is like fast times like 12, or I don't even know if it's that much, but it's really fast is the uh, point I'm trying to make. The MacBook delivers a segment leading 9 hours of battery life, and I think that's pretty ridiculous. Like at first I was super skeptical, but it actually is pretty true. The Mac does have a uh, ridiculously good battery life. I can use this thing like two or three hours, four hours, one day, and I'll still have juice for the next three days, and it's just great from going from my old computer where I was charging every, uh, every, after every time I use it, to now charging like twice a week, once a week, it's, it's really nice. Overall, if you're long overdue for an upgrade, or you just want to go pro, this Mac is perfect for you, because it has all the uh, horsepower, it has a battery life, it has a beautiful screen, it has a fast SSD, it has a nice touchpad, force touch, it has a, a, a great keyboard, great speakers, everything is super good about it. It's uh, pretty light too for what it is. So I would go ahead and recommend this to anyone in the, Mac, in the Mac, in the market for a 15 inch notebook. Go ahead and check this out. Um, anyway, Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe. That's what's up. That's what's up.